Hello everyone, this is Valhalla Gaming TV, and we're back with Madison again on episode 5. I'm hoping this is going to be the final one, because this game is terrifying. And, uh, yeah, let's get back into it. Let's get this over with. Alright, we read that note. Let's go check out what's down here. Looks like they nailed that- Oh, There must be something useful here. Yeah, I can see that. We got a table saw. Got some propane. And we got our bolt cutters. That's what we're looking for. Oh, and I'm full on my inventory. Again. I like hoarding everything. Can we turn this on? Let's mess with the fuses. Okay, let's... Let's do the first one. Okay, up, down, down. Up, down, up, up, down. Up, down, up. Up, up, down. No, it's all up. Up, down, up, 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 up. Can we use this now? Oh, there's something over here. Another one. Let's try this one. Up. Nope. Down. 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 Up. Down. Okay. Down, 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 up. I just did that again. Up, up, up. Down, 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 up, up, down. Ooh, the saw's on. Maybe we can do it on that box. Moon box time. Here we go. Ooh, back up. Where's the safety goggles? What's in this bad boy? Ew, stinky. Examine. Oh, are these all the body parts? Okay, it's pictures of all the body parts. That's probably the sacrifice thing we need. Were those candles there before? I don't even know. Alright, let's get this ritual on the road. Time to do that demon work. Achievable. Bloodiest. Oh, crap. Make the virgins cry. Okay, I think we just take a picture. Whoop. Oh. Nuh uh. I just thought about that. Now what? Human ashes. No, we got the seven sacrifices. Oh, something's hitting the wall here. Hello? I need to find the four digits to open this door. They must be somewhere. Yeah, they must be somewhere. Wait a minute. What about the the um the diary page? Oh, here we go. We also got this. Is that always here? Let's go listen to it. Maybe it's got the numbers in it. Or maybe it's 1972 or something. Ooh, careful now. Oh, we got bolt cutters. Okay. Okay, there's stuff moving over there. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Not doing that yet. Let's listen to this cool tape. 1972. I'm carrying too much already. Oh, I have to pull that one out. Mother trucker. How am I still carrying too much? Got the shovel thing. I don't even think I need this shovel anymore. I keep grabbing it thinking I need it. Alright, let's go to the safe real quick and drop something off. Oh. That's getting knocked down, man. I think the demons are coming. Oh, it's knocking stuff off the wall. Store some stuff. That needs a backpack. But we don't want to take. We I want to store it first. Trying to make room. Okay, let's just get rid of the hammer and the shovel because I don't think we need that right now. I'll keep the rest. I'm a hoarder. Ooh, and we still haven't gotten anything for those uh, those clocks or those safes. Let's listen to this first. 
And there we go. John, I must stress to you how dangerous these demons really are. I've witnessed a few exorcisms in my time. Not everyone lived to tell the tale. These beings are not alive, and that makes them stronger than us. They entertain themselves with us. They enjoy our fear, causing us pain. They feed off of it. It gives them power, gives them strength. When one of them becomes attached to one of us, it's all but impossible to stop. They play with our bodies and minds. Does this mean that? Until they find what they were that looking that woman for. Is attached to the no longer human. Attached they are to me? Beyond everything we know. John, I implore She's you. She's no longer human. Seek she? help. I'll investigate that woman you told me about. Um, Madison Hale. And I'll get back to you as soon as I find something. Keep all of this information away from your son. Get rid of that camera as soon as you get this message, but please, please do be careful. If your child has already had contact with this entity, his life, yours, and your family's are in Mom. jeopardy. Chanel, what have I done? Mm. I need to find a way to end this. Fuck. <laughs> it burns. Falling apart, My man. body burns. Horror horns. Oh, we got a notebook entry. I think I've seen something like this in the house. Where did we see this? I remember seeing no horns. And again, my memory's not very good, so I don't know. All right, let's grab that. Let's go store these, because I know we got to open some stuff. I hear you knocking in there. We'll get in there. Calm down. All right, let's store this. I guess we'll look for horns. And store the cassette tapes. All right, we got three slots. That should be okay. And what is this? Priest Thomas? Uh, I hope this is useful. Please be careful. Remember, we talked about it. Uh, I'll get back to you as soon as possible. I know the tapes are old. Okay. Yeah, we read that earlier. We first did the episodes. Okay, let's go cut some chains. Apparently, in this creepy kitchen that keeps moving stuff. And poltergeist. Okay. Let's cut it open. What do we got in here? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, cool. Collectible. All right. Okay, well, that didn't do much. Let's go look in the toilet. Hopefully, we find something for these clocks. Toilet, where you be? What is those noises, man? Okay. Do not use. We're using it. I've been holding it in the entire time I've been playing this, okay? Yeah, no. No, no. We're going to close that. Need some privacy while I use this thing. Open. What is that? Is that a piece of concrete? Oh, God. How many times do I have to tell you there's nobody in this house? Al I'm done with your bullshit. Albert, listen to me. It's just a book. A fucking book, Elizabeth. See? There's no one here. It doesn't exist. It's not real, goddammit. I know. Everything that's happening to me has something to do with it. I just know it. It's a disease, Elizabeth. You are sick, for the Lord's sake. I'm not sick. You'll end up losing your mind if you don't cut the crap. That book has nothing to do with your illness. I wish you stopped acting like a child. Stop hiding our stuff and take your goddamn pill. Jesus! Do, do you think it's normal? Do you think pupils vanish like dust? I'm telling you that that, that 
fucking thing is what's causing Enough, this for me. Enough, Elizabeth. Stop acting like a ten-year-old and go to bed. Albert, everything started the day we brought that fucking book to this house. It's a disease, Elizabeth. If you don't believe me, I will leave this place. I'm done. And I'm taking Johnny with me. We are not staying hey, hey, here. Hey, wait a minute. This is... You're paranoid. Go back to bed before we wake up Johnny. Come on. Talk about this. You're gonna regret this. You'll end up all alone. Just you and your stupid fucking clock. Oh god. Oh god. Come on, man, no. Don't do this to me. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Hello? Hello? Oh! Why, why are you closing the door on me? breaking stuff. Was this open before? It's locked. That's locked too. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, that's her eyes. We saw that before. I opened the toilet. It, what, it gave me like a concrete block. Yeah. What do I use this for? Doesn't really tell me much. Do I bash over the demon? Can we, can we chill out on the sounds, please? Open this up. Grandma's diary. Okay, and it's all 1972 through here. Yeah, it's all 1972, so maybe that's the four-digit number we were looking for. Now let's go try it on the door. I don't remember if I tried that or not on the door. Might as well try it. All these noises. And what about here? Any numbers on here? Try nineteen seventy two. The one nine seven. Two. No? What about 87? What about 1951? What about 2022? None of those numbers. It's on the wall here. Just scribbles everywhere. Any numbers in this book? There's the seven sacrifices. Feel out with the noises. Cut. Oh, Grampy. We tried 1968. I remember, right? That's what we first tried. That did not work. Try it one more time. 1968. Nope. Okay. We gotta find a number elsewhere. 
if I remember right, we should be using... Jeez. We should be using the, uh, insects. Those have been showing me where I'm supposed to be going. Let's look around for some insects. Maybe that'll give us a hint. Then this chair moved. Anything in here? We got that concrete block, so there must be something I need to break, maybe? Okay. See nothing. Going to the other rooms. Gotta find our way through this place. And find a four digit number somewhere. What about this door? That one's locked. Oh, well, we still got this too. Ooh. That fell down. Yeah, what did that do? No, 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 no not again. No, fuck. I, I can't feel my fingers. What is happening to my body? I would say you're possessed, man. Uh, I, I don't know what this could mean. There was a red light, but everything was dark. Now we gotta find a red... Ooh, okay. So this just fell down. This must have been the horns we were looking for. And then the red light is this way. Alright, let's go to the red light. creepy clock. Okay. A little different. Why is that on the ceiling now? Easy now. Okay. Pictures will be taken. That's the red light right there. Oh, God. That gave me the chills. All right, let's go through here. What do we do here? Okay, this is still like, we still gotta get these open. You know where to find the combination. Actually, I do not. Is that a keyhole? Oh, that's a nail. Any numbers over here? Nothing that seems to be relevant. There's a phone number. Is there anywhere else that we saw a red light? Go look around again. Okay, so the only red light, wait a minute, is the red light like a, a bulb or was it, ah, see that light right there? I think those are the emergency lights, yeah, ooh, creepy noises, okay, so if that's the emergency lights, Oh, man. Do we got to do what I think we got to do? I think we might have to turn the power off to the house. Ooh. Okay. Let's go try it. Oh. Is it with the noises? What the hell am I doing? Yep, it's red. Now what? Where do we look? The, the doorbell. I, I gotta get to the front door. 
Where's the front door at? Where is the front door? Okay. I thought I knew where that thing was. All the sounds, I guess. They're ringing. Oh, it's dark in here. Oh, God damn it. Jesus Christ. Oh, come on. Oh, God. I need a new change of pants on this one. You still there, lady? Oh, my God. Into the dark. Here it goes. Okay. He's going to pop out again. I know it. Just run. Oh, wow. Okay. This don't look good. <laughs> She's playing with my mind. There is no It is still unknown if she was under the influence of any drugs or if it was actually a witchcraft ritual as indicated by the evidence found at the scene. Suggesting the latter, police officers found books at the scene containing strange symbols, candles, dead animals, and one of the more macabre details. Madison mutilated his body in such a way that his face was unrecognizable. His body was found in pieces inside the well along with the other corpses. So far, his left leg and three fingers have not been found. Uh, I wonder what these numbers are for. The first victim was her own 75-year-old father. Madison mutilated his body in such a way that his face was unrecognizable. His body was found in pieces inside the well. Sounds like Okay, I think it's just repeating over and over again. It said Robert Hill over there. And this is number three. And this is... Hmm. Can I take a picture here? Nineteen eighty seven Robert Hill. I don't know what we're supposed to do here. He does say three here though. So I'll leave that there. Let's go to the next floor. Level two. Oh, come on. Real dark in here. The second victim was her 71-year-old mother. Who is dark in here? According to police reports, Madison amputated. 
Ooh, it's dark. Ooh. Okay, I don't know what those numbers are supposed to be. I'm gonna go up into the floor. Too spooky. Way too scared. Give me about the other floors first. There's holes in these walls. Uh, what's in this one? Alfred Miller. Maybe I can break the wall with something. Probably need the hammer, don't I? Crowbar. Man. As well. Gotta find something. The third victim was a 27 year old man. Madison hit his head with a sharp object repeatedly. The young man died in the four. His body was dismembered as well. The third victim was a 27 year old it man. It keeps repeating. Ooh. Ooh, there's a collectible there. On the way back down, we'll have to remember that. In here. I guess it wants us to break the walls, but we don't got nothing to break it with. George Brown. What about the top level? Let's go to five. That's creepy. You, you, you. That's a mirror. You, you, you. Here? You, you, Nothing? Okay. There are no numbers on this one. Alright, let's look in the mirror. There's a chair there. In a noose. Ooh. This is scary. Get your time. Oh wait, I might be able to take a picture of myself. No, oh, I don't see anything. That is so creepy. I don't see nothing. And these seem to be changed around. Are they supposed to be lined up? And there's stuff all over the floor. What is my name? Adam Rose. Do those sounds, man. Maybe I'm supposed to find my name. Not John, that was the dad. Linda Carter. It makes me. Oh, it wants me to take a picture right here, I think. But I might have to have everything lined up first.
Yeah, I'm not seeing the name. Let's get downstairs a little bit more. That is creeping me out. The top one looks like it's lined up. Go to the ground floor. I wonder if I can go back to the safe to get my uh, um, my hammer. Oh god. Oh god, it stop. Come on, man. The buttons. Oh, what's going? Ooh, what's going on? I didn't get it. Oh, this is messed up. Okay, let's try to get back and get the hammer. Alright. Let's go get that hammer. We gotta go back to the safe. Oh god, please don't pop out. Oh, there she is again. God damn it. Just run. Just run. Screw it. Nope, 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 nope. I knew that was gonna happen. No more flitches, no more pitches. Oh. Keep it moving. Gotta get back to the room where the safe is. Do I should have kept that hammer on me. At least this guy can run. Keep it going. Those broadcasts uh, on each one of those floors, something's got to... It's got to uh, work with something there. Let's grab the hammer. Pretty sure that's all we're going to need. The door's shut. Come on. They got to play me like this. I don't want to use it. E come on, just run. I'm not using the freaking camera. She's going to uh, come out again. I'm just going to run back and go through the darkness. All right, hold on to your, hold on to your pants because we're going. We ain't slowing down. When I'm scared, I charge. Charge, charge, charge. Come on. No more saggy boob lady. Scary, creepy, old gravity infested lady. Okay, here we go. Let's go to the first floor. It doesn't seem to say the names, but there was a number. 75 years old. Vincent Patterson, 1890 to 1947. It's 57. Right over here. That is not 75. 1987. What's the year? 2002? Okay, so that's 90. Wait a minute. It's 1987. 1915 to 1970. The 75-year-old father. I don't see anybody that's 75. Unless I'm doing my math wrong. 1890, 1947. So that'd be 10 years. Plus 47, that's 1957. Or, that's 57 years old. 1689. That's way old. 1915 to 1970. That's like 55. Huh. 
That's almost 75 years. Nope. Well, Robert Hell, I'm pretty sure that was him, so let's just take a picture of that. Alright. Let's go up to the next one. Let me figure the other ones out. And this is the dark room. Here we go with the dark room. It is so dark in here, I don't want to take any pictures. Just keep walking. There's a whole... 71. 1902 to 1937. Come on. Ooh, the light turned on. What's that noise? Oh, God. Nope, I ain't messing with that. I just got out of there. What's over here? You did hell. Okay. I think that's it, too. Get your... Keep moving. And let's go to floor three. I'm way too scared for this crap. Twenty-seven year old man. Open the door, please. Well, this elevator sucks. Twenty-seven. Hammer time. Yeah. Nineteen sixty to eighty-seven. That's twenty-seven. Drake Fletcher. Next one. We also have that collectible. Let's see if we can get it. Collectible. Boom. Got it. Hey. Wait, did I miss one? Crap, I think I missed one. We are on three, weren't we? Come on, elevator, please. Mess with me, man. Let's drop down to four. I think I passed it. God, that's creepy. Work for me, elevator. 13 pieces. Okay, 35. How is this person? 1952, it doesn't, I can't read it. The final victim was a 35 year old woman. Madison stabbed her at her own front door. Neighbors witnessed her dragging the body into the And this the is creepy. Hello? 2001. Oh! What's going on? Is that it? I'm just gonna go with this one. Hopefully that's the right one. Keep moving. And I think that was a woman. I, I got. Uh, okay, I'm scared. Okay, I'm scared. What do we do here? There's holes in the walls. I think we just take a picture. Unless something got wrong. Okay. Let's go back down. I think I messed up the last one. Four, four. Maybe it's the lady on the... It's the left one, I think. The one where we couldn't read it or anywhere? 35 years old. 
I can't see anything behind it. Let's try this one. Oh, it's saying you here now. This must be it. Here's the moment of truth. Let's see if we get out of anything out of this. Fill the news. Let's take a picture. Oh, yep, something happened. Ooh, what's that? What's well, a key? And it's got a clock on it. it. Must be for that door. Let's look at that picture I just took. It looks like a five. What was that other one? One where we took a picture of the horns. Looks like a zero. I'm gonna write this down real quick. Okay, I wrote it down. So far it's zero five. Let's head back to the ground floor. Enough with the you, man. So we got two numbers. Oh, something's going. Oh god, there she is. Oh my god, come on. Not another one. Stand in the corner. Oh, the lights are off. To the ground floor, man. Let's get out of here. My poor little heart can't handle it. <laughs> Turn the damn lights on. Let's go. Why does it keep saying you? Okay. Okay. Oh god, it's still dark, man. All right, screw it. We're just running, no pictures. Here it goes. Here we go. It's saving. Something's gonna happen. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. No pictures. Tired of seeing the creepy lady? Let's go turn the lights on. Tired of the dark. That's the key for that that clock room, I think. Keep it moving, keep it moving, turn it on. Power it out. Oh, the lights. Oh, God. I don't want to get too comfortable yet. Okay. Open the door. Where's the key? There we go. We're making progress. Wow, it goes down. It goes really far down. Oh, God. <laughs> My body. Uh, my hands. This is what the priest was talking about. That thing is. <laughs> thing is feeding off of me. Uh. What the fuck does this even mean? The house is full of clocks. Anybody got the time? Oh, it's one of those. Okay. Is that another one? They're all over the place. What's this? Can we use the wire cutter? Bolt cutter? Yeah, we can. What do we got in here? Oh, look at that. Nine left. Eleven. Oh, getting the combination. Okay, let me write this down. Nine left. All right. So there's another piece of the puzzle. Let's see what's in here. Nothing. Grandpa used to work in here. Hey, you think? Holy clocks. This is the kind of guy that always knew what time it was. That's locked. We can't open that. Okay, but I think we... Oof. I think we got the second part of that uh, combination. Okay, and the other part was in the bathroom, I think. Open sesame. And then this one says... Okay, that's right. So it's 9 left, 11 right, and 8 left. Okay, so combination 9 left, 11 right, 8 left. Let's go test it out. 
Yeah, I'm not looking. Screw you. Do not care no more. I'm in speed mode. Okay, that. Well, the door's not there no more. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Is she chasing me? Okay, okay, okay. Oh, my God. Woo. I got chills through my whole body right now. Is it cold in here? Because that's got a chill. Big one. Whole body chill. Ah, oh, that sucked. I hate it. Okay. We got a combination here. It's got to be for this one, clearly. Okay, so we got nine left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We got 11 right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then eight left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah! Okay, what do we got here? A reading material. John, my son, I'm an old man already, and life has passed to all of us. I am so proud to see the man you've become. So happy to have deeply enjoyed the two grandchildren that you gave me, Luca and Chanel. I write this letter so that one day you can understand everything that's going on through my mind right now and debunk the myth that I'm a crazy old man. God does exist, and just like him does Satan. All my life I tried hard to not believe, but time has shown me I was profoundly mistaken. Your mother was not sick at all, and I couldn't prevent her sad ending from happening. As far-fetched as it sounds, Blue Knees is real. Not a single specialist was able to trace down the cause of her condition, not to mention find a treatment to help her fight. I truly wish I could go back in time and tell her I believe you. I kept trying to contact her for over 15 years. I just wanted to speak with her just one last time. Soon we'll meet again, and I'll beg her to forgive me. This loneliness reminds me day after day how hard it gets to live without my most precious and beloved person in the world. At least I can see her face in every room of this huge house. Regarding the book, I tried to burn it, tear it, bury it, bury it, but there's no use bothering. It somehow manages to get back. Anyway, I know keep it in my possession under lock and key. I will not allow history to repeat itself. Thank you for being the son I've always dreamt to have. Love your dad, Albert Maxwell. That's crazy. Oh, we got a clock. Oh, look at that. Ooh, noises. Okay. And then this safe is still locked. We don't have a combination for that. Unless it's the same combination. I doubt it, but let's give it a shot real quick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope, no luck. All right, but we do have that clock thing. How exactly are we supposed to use that? We put it here. Ooh. And we pull the clock off. Interesting. So she's around the house now. So we're supposed to switch him out. Maybe the clock. Oh, God damn it. Oh. Screw yourself, evil lady. We need more puzzle pieces, man. We need more of uh, the, the numbers for that door. Oh, these jump scares are getting me bad. I'm so worn out. All right, let's get back to the clock room. There's clocks everywhere. And then that door has got a clock on it. Those seem to be all in sync. But these are all different. And these aren't in sync, but the other ones are. Wait a minute. 
Okay, so maybe we're supposed to match it for the clocks on the wall. Like this one says that time. Let's see, there's another one over here, right? And this one is doing that time right there, which is, what is that like? 7.45? Does it move once the minute hand gets all the way over there? I think it just stays the same. Which one do I got? 7.45. That's the one. And what's this? That's 7.45. What's the one I got? 8.20. And... That is... 1.30. This is... 11.55. And that is 9.30. So this isn't the one we need. What does this one say? That's like 3. And then this one... Like 1. Alright. Alright, we know what we gotta do with the clocks. But we're gonna have to save that one for the next episode. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this. This game is continuing to be terrifying and mentally i'm done okay but we got to finish it we got it all right everyone if you enjoyed this content and you like seeing me suffer leave a comment down below tell me how you enjoy it or if you don't and i'll see you in the next one appreciate it later